Hey guys, what's going on out there? Today we're going to be boarding a few beavers, so stay tuned and um, you know check out my way of doing things. See you guys. All right, you guys, let's uh, put this beaver on the board. So I've already used up my other uh, measuring board uh, with the previous beaver, so I just got to use a piece of plywood here. Um, this one, you can see I uh, tore the foot on the, the pan trap that I caught it in, so I did a tear in the skin. And then I made a small puncture back here that I'm just going to be careful with. I'll end up cutting around, but, you know, made a mistake. I'm still a rookie at this. Um, I'm using an arrow electric stapler. Seems to be the most efficient um, for me. So let's start up here, right around the face. I try to get it as tight as I can. Um, the outside <clears throat> still has that circular shape. Um, and then we can go back and put some staples between these. I've got them about, I'd say about two and a half, three inches apart. I left a little meat around this leg. I was afraid to cut anymore because, like I said, I caught this beaver on a back foot pan trap and it kind of you know, broke that foot up and tore the, the hide. Looks like we got another, another one on the board, so 
Uh, stay tuned, I've got a few more you guys, and uh, I'm probably going to trim um, around this, this area. And you know what, I've already exposed a little bit, so whatever happens, happens. So stay tuned, you guys. All right, you guys, so we boarded um, two beavers. So you got a larger one here and a smaller one, but um, I think we're done for the night. May have some more footage coming to you guys, but um, stay tuned. Uh, we're going to be doing some um, minks, and I'm sorry, minks, otters here soon. So, uh, you know, stay tuned for more content, you guys. We'll see you guys next time. Hey, you guys, it's uh, Jojo, my friend, 301, just coming back with a short video to give you an update on uh, those beaver pelts that we did. Um, I ended up cleaning the hides uh, after I was done uh, drying them out and scraping them off. And then I also um, got some tannin solution in on them. So uh, they turned out really good. They're pretty stiff right now. I actually had them wedged up against the wall. But you can see, um, I mean, they're clean. Uh, they're nice. Uh, I think I'm going to uh, upholster them on like a old school pack out hunting bag. Um, just to kind of give uh, something for my mounts on the wall. I'll show you guys one of those. Uh, what I did with my previous beaver um, hides that I wasn't able to sell. So you can currently see I'm working on another project as well. I was able to knock down a long beard uh, last week. Of course, I cut him up. Um, I'm going to put some on the smoker this weekend, but uh, I laid him out. I'm doing a unique mount. Um, something I've never done before, but I got a few tips. Um, I'm going to put all those tags on the video when I put it out, but uh, it's going to be a really cool mount. It's going to be kind of a, a full cape um, of the turkey. You can see I have the wings spread out, the fan at the bottom. Um, it's going to be really cool, so stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, I'm going to show you the... Uh, beaver pelts that um, I've done before and I incorporated into a wall mount. So, hold on one moment. Here's a full on bird. It's going to look pretty sweet. Let's see, so... Where do I have that one? There we go. So I rolled <clears throat> this mount. I had a few beaver hides and a couple squirrel tails um, and another deer skull that I did. So I put all those together and incorporated them um, with this mount. Um, I did all that myself. So it was actually a nice, nice deer, young deer though that I harvested um, a while back. And it's kind of like a, a backpack old school. Um, style mount but what I'm going to do is uh, something similar to that but I'm going to add like the wood planks kind of like the uh, old mountain men used to hike out of the hike out of the woods with but I think that's everything I'm going to be able to show you guys tonight but stay tuned because we've got this other video um, with the turkey which I've got right behind me and I think you guys are going to like that. So stay tuned. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe. Jojo, my friend, 301. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Take care.